With regards to the workflow, the Apple Vision Pro is new. So the Vision OS framework is just being looked at now. Um, however, they've also provided robust support for Unity and there have been rumors of experimental support for Unreal Engine in the near to mid future. One challenge with fixed hardware is that more developer time is needed up front. And that's because you need to iterate in order to optimize for this hardware. Therefore, you're, you're facing a longer overall development and testing phase. Whereas with the Quest 3, developers can use a wider range of real-time tool sets thanks to the adoption of uh, the OpenVR API. And that basically unifies the development across various headsets. And that means you're also not limited to the processing power inside the headset. And you can simply plug in to a PC and uh, experience much richer content.